Fox 56 is recognizing heroes within the community with our monthly series salute to first responders. Tonight we are highlighting athletic trainers at Wilkes University and their outstanding work providing critical care when athletes get hurt. Fox 56's Taylor Whartonby has more. From sprains, fractures, head injuries, and even severe cases such as cardiac emergencies, athletic trainers are the first responders to rush into action, providing critical care. For 13 years, Camille Dodignac has been the head athletic trainer at Wilkes University, employed by Guy Singer. Our duties here range anywhere from um, injury recognition, whether it's down on the field and, and, and it, uh, an injured athlete goes down, um, we're kind of the first on the scene there. Um, then, you know, after the, that first injury recognition, kind of go into, um, we do a lot of rehab and treatment um, with our student athletes as well. Our Geisinger element is also, you know, knowing when to properly refer student athletes. We're there from the very beginning of initial injury and we get to help them through the recovery um, and hopefully get them back on, out onto the field. With 23 varsity sports, Dodiniak says they have four athletic trainers, which gives them the flexibility to be at various sites. Initial injuries, you know, we're down on the field during practice or a game. Um, you know, whether it's a sprain or a strain, we kind of do an on-field evaluation there. Um, if it's something more serious, you know, we have to activate emergency action plan. If it's a, a serious fracture or, like I said, a, um, a C-spine injury, cardiac emergency, we're activating um, EMS. So it's really rewarding to see them, you know, rec recover and get back onto the field to um, doing what they really love. I spoke to Cody Yale, an athletic training student from East Stroudsburg University, who graduates in two weeks. I'm just here to help out the athletic trainers um, with everything they do, and I'm just pretty much just getting education and experience and while still helping them do their job. I grew up playing sports, I love sports, and I spent a lot of time in the athletic training room myself is just injuries and in general and I kind of just fell in love with it just watching that they do. I have a graduate assistant position to work at Lamar University which is in Texas so I'm going to be moving down there and hopefully taking my career off from there. Camille says for every game, practice or competition they are right there. As athletic trainers they don't want to see injuries occur however they are inevitable. Reporting in Luzerne County I'm Taylor Whartonby with Fox 56 News first at 10. If you know any first responders we should highlight next month, reach out to us on any Fox 56 social media page.